Hi everybody, I'm Dawn, welcome to my channel. Thank you for visiting with me today. You are in my workroom. So this back here is all my FX makeup, all of that, just not organized. My FX travel bag, all that. I'm organizing, I'm cleaning up, I'm packing, because even though I said we're not buying a house yet, we are going to be renting a bigger place. So, um, but we're putting the home buying off for a little while longer. It's just, I don't want to deal with the aggravation right now. Um, but Eric bought me an annual pass to Disney and I'm going to, uh, I, I have a trip planned for next month and I'm very excited and I was able to get all the reservations I wanted except for one. I couldn't get a reservation at Topolino's, um, but I was able to get all the other reservations I wanted. So that's good news. That's good news. Um, so I'm very excited about that. I'll be vlogging it. There'll be a lot to see. So I hope you enjoy Disney-esque content. Cause you're gonna get something from me very soon. Very, very soon. I also wanted to talk about, so the other night I made a video where I reacted to Exposing the Good Wives Network video where they show uh, Sarah's video of what happened um, that morning of the big assault and, um, so, you know, videos that came after that with, you know, the lies that um, April was spewing. So people are under the impression, not all of y'all, most of y'all have brains, but people are under the impression that I'm beating Fancy up. Have y'all ever seen this woman? Have you watched her behavior? She is unhinged. She beats people up. She's a bully, she's mean, she lies about people. I know that firsthand because she lied about me. She's a liar and you can't trust a damn word she says. And if you think that's beating her up, pointing that stuff out is beating her up, you got problems because you're getting me when I talk about fancy, you're getting me at 10%. If I kick it up to even just 50%, you would be clutching your pearls. You would not be able to handle it. So give me a break with that. I'm beating her up. I'm not beating her up. It's probably she hasn't been beat up enough in her life. She's just, she's a spoiled, rotten, evil, mean bitch. She is. And if you don't see that, you know, I, I don't know what to say about it. You're blind. You're blind as hell. She is not a decent human being. And, um... And yes, I realize Sarah is a grown woman and she is responsible for her own actions. And she is, in my opinion, more responsible for what happened because she was there at the front and there was no yelling, there was no shoving, there was no chest bump, there was no her falling back because the camera would have been askewed. The, the camera would have jumped. There was none of that. So that right there is a lie. Um, there was no yelling. He, nobody was yelling. Nobody was pushing. No one was shoving. No one was chest bumping. None of that was happening. And that was in the video that we all saw. And I know people are like, well, you couldn't see it from the other side. It, the camera would have shook. And, you know, apparently they have video of the other side from the hotel. So I'm sorry. I, I don't, I don't want people to feel like I'm being mean to Sarah, but she is a grown woman and she is responsible for what, you know, what went down. I do feel like, cause you heard Fancy's big mouth in the background when she was saying, I am the media. You heard her go, she is the media, you know? Um, I heard it. I don't know if y'all heard it, but I heard it. And, you know, she was involved. She definitely pushed her to go over there. She manipulated the situation, but, um, and then she backed down on it. She backed down on it, said, no, I told her, I yelled at her to come back over there. I didn't hear that on the video. I didn't hear, Sarah, come back over here. I didn't hear that. I didn't hear that at all. So, yeah, whatever, but, 
I'm beating Fancy up. I'm beating her up. Fancy isn't getting beat up by me. Y'all have never seen an ass whooping if you think that I'm beating her up. She committed a crime and they need to both be held accountable for it. They both committed a crime. Filing a false police report is a serious crime. And uh, look, I said this in the last video, it's on the doc, it's on the documents, it's on the court documents. This isn't the first time Sarah has filed a false police report. And I have questions for Sarah, like, um, can she share the details of the false police report charge from before? Because it wasn't just a charge, she was convicted. So what was that about? What happened? What were the details of that? She didn't learn from, from that error. She didn't learn from that mistake that, you know, maybe don't do that again. Because the first time, maybe it's a mistake, but actually filing a false police report that takes work, that takes time, that you, you're, you're going in there, you're filing the report, you're deciding to do it. That's actually not a mistake, it's a decision. You know what I mean? I just gotta calm this down a little bit. It's a little too harsh, in my opinion. So yes, yeah, Sarah has filed a false police report before it's nothing new but me beating fancy up no but she's not a decent person not sarah i don't know much about sarah all i know about sarah is what i know about this incident i don't know a lot about her because i never followed the good wives network because it's i never even heard of them really before until I was researching the medical records thing and being like, oh, this is not good. Um, but, and people are also under the impression that I came for Fancy. I did not. She came for me when I made my HIPAA video because she didn't like what I had to say because she didn't like the truth. And she was trying to twist the truth and she's convinced her supporters that I'm wrong and they're all stupid. Because, and then people were like, well, you need to check the law in Missouri. I don't have to check the law in Missouri. HIPAA is HIPAA everywhere. HIPAA is the same everywhere. And then each state has the right to have even stricter um, rules. So the rules I discussed are across the board and they are not bendable. They're only bendable in the way to make them more strict. So. whatever <laughs> but yeah i'm not coming for for fancy i'm not beating her up although i have asked youtube to sanction a cage match you know i do think it's pathetic that a 50 year old woman has to um you know beg her who acts like she has this successful production company and everything has to beg her um, supporters for money to get home from another city, you know, after she already begged them for money to get there. I think it's pathetic. I do. And yes, I know people struggle. I understand that. But most people also don't sit there and beg for money from other people. They don't get themselves in the situations, you know, that they actually got themselves into. Look how red my head is. They don't 
you know, grown people of that big age don't get themselves into these situations and then expect other people to bail them out, no matter how much they're struggling. But yeah, I understand that people struggle, but I mean, they, you know, took up their big, you know, collection, got their collection pot, went to St. Louis, did their thing there, and um, decided to stay a few days. No, you don't have money. You go do what you got to do, you come home. That's, <laughs> Ugh. I don't know. I can't believe people are still giving her money, too. But yeah, help her pay her legal fund because she can't keep her freaking mouth shut. But yeah, I'm coming for her. I'm coming for her. I'm the problem. I'm the problem. Oh, well. It's okay. I have to... So I saved this because this is a little fruit bag. I saved it because you use this and you can make uh scales so that'll be fun to use fun to play with but anyway that's really it that's all i have to say um i'm gonna go get dressed and then me and eric are gonna do a taste test video later he's taking a nap right now but i am also working on a video on illuminati and it is it is a lot of work to do so that's what i'm working on right now but i will talk to everyone later bye